Today we have about 8,200 students. If we have a lot, if we have more of the state supported. We have housing, which I think is the best housing of any university in California, if not anywhere else. We have eight, appli eight applications for every seat available. You have a, and a, your academic standing is uh, among the top. The uh, endowment of this institution, when I came here, was less than two million dollars. All came, you know, now it's over thirty-eight million dollars. But the institution changed. I asked, let me. I'll, I'll, how many of you are from outside Santa Rosa, Donner Park, etc.? 80% 80 of you. That was not Sonoma State in the 1990s. So we had to change to do that. Those changes have, there are some people who don't like those changes, who were very comfortable in teaching, you know, very bright, very dedicated, 35, 45-year-old mothers of two, not 20, 18, 20, 22-year-old, hormone raging, uh, you know, young men and young women uh, who has interest bes beside uh, just going to school and raising a family. You know, the faculty we hire today is really super faculty. We're very competitive, but change always threatens people who want the status quo. And, and therefore, I'm that of uh, that I am guilty of. But a question. Yes. yes no. Well, you said all of the big changes, but you forgot to mention the class cuts, the teacher cuts. I would rather live off campus in a shoebox and have more teachers with more substance and more classes so I don't have to only sign up for nine units at a time. Like, what can you say about those changes? Why don't you mention those changes? Because they are imposed to us by the state of California. The people who are not funding you to have those things and to the fact that we have dropped enrollment by 500 students this year and the next is because the state of California has reduced the uh, funding of these universities just in the last 18 months by $17 million. So there's money going to other places. Why can't we just put it back to the students? Oh, great our, question. Our stuff keeps going up, and then our classes keep going down. It's not going to be worth it to come to this college pretty soon. Well, and I, I understand that, but then you see, see how well you do in going to any of the other CSUs. Let me answer your question. You had a question about housing. There's money and there's money. And capital money, money which is destined for buildings. Toscan is a lot, this building, any other building. Not a penny, not a, a penny can be spent for operations. And if, if you do that, I go to jail. Therefore, and, and this seems almost anachronistic, that so you have, at some time, the operating money is going down significantly. This university has lost over 30% in the last 10 years. And capital money is doing better. Capital money is bond money. And, there, and, and it can only be used to do that. That's how we built 
the housing, that's how we built the, the uh, Schulz Information Center, that's how we renovated this building. But not a penny, not a penny of that money can go to pay more teachers or to pay salaries of anybody, etc. And those are two different separate pots of money which can never be crossed. 